Dragons, welcome to your reading for uh, July 2021. Um, please do be sure to like and subscribe to my channel. I do appreciate it. Um, just a little announcement. I'm taking away doing the weekly readings and I'm going to be doing a mid-month reading for every sign. So my weeklies used to be for um, the element and then I'd break it up in per sign and you'd only get like about a four minute reading for the week. So I decided instead that for each sign, I'm gonna do a monthly reading and that will be about 15 minutes-ish. So um, I just wanna spend more time with the signs and I'm gonna see how that works out. Now I'm still gonna be doing the moons and I'm still doing the bonuses. Now my bonuses are still very much based on these readings that you're listening to right now. So please do be sure to like and and to view it and to subscribe because all I take all of those things into consideration while I decide whose bonuses I do first so and the reason I do bonuses like that is to keep it fair so because if I don't get to do the end ones then the ones with the least views I won't do if I need to be able to have time for you know my life that pays my bills so I don't make any money doing this. I love to do this. I love giving you guys love, but I um, I do this for you guys. I do this as a passion to try to help, okay? So let's get on with your reading, Leo. So what I'm pulling from this is there's a lot of very young and sort of crazy energy happening with you. Now, pages are usually to do with kids, but I don't feel that there's kids. Um, page, I'm feeling there's a lot of, um, like you got the page of swords. So first, let me get to how I'm coming with this. Page is a high priestess in reverse, okay? Could be Pisces. This is a uh, hidden agendas, okay? I feel like, and when I pull the cards, I say for Leo, this is for Leo. This isn't somebody else. This is you. This is your energy. Now, just because I say that, it might sound familiar, but you might, might be like, whoa, that's not me. That's somebody else I'm dealing with. Okay, so just take it as it is. I'm going to speaking be speaking as though it is you. Okay, but feel free to exchange the energy. Okay, I'm just picking up on energy. This is what the cards are picking up on. High Priestess in Reverse. I'm really getting the feeling like you have a hidden agenda about somebody and that you're stalking them. This is the Page of Swords. I really feel like you're being a stalker. Um, not really a great quality, but who knows? Um, who knows what this hidden, hidden agenda is for? You have the Page of Wands, so, but it's, excuse me, in reverse. So you have a setback or a lack of direction. I feel like you want to go into new love, but you're, I feel like you're just stalking them. You're just in stalker mode, guys. You're not really going on. You're just like, you can, it's like you sort of go and then you sort of get thrown back. And then you try and you get thrown back. Um, now, the other thing that this could mean is, is that you are watching somebody very closely and you keep trying to do something and that something is not coming into fruition this way. Um, it, the... Page of Wands in reverse um, could be that you're just very pessimistic um, or that you haven't planned. So don't forget, all these pages are very young energy. There's no kings and your high priestess is in reverse. So there's a lot of, um, it's a lot of young energy going on. So I'm not too sure who this is. I, I'm hoping it's a young playful energy. Please don't stalk people. Okay. <laughs> So let's see what we can get to clarify with this. Three pages. Pages are supposed to be sort of new starts. But that page of wands in reverse in the middle, that's putting like a stop. That's like stop to your new starts. So, and also if you are stalking people, nobody likes being stalked. You know, it's kind of not good and it's a lot of like crazy energy going on here okay come on cards can I get more I should really just see what this one is page 
So you have the Page of Swords in reverse over the Page of Swords in the upright. This is what I mean by confused. So you're like all talk, no action, right? You're, you're not, you're, you're like, you're stalking somebody and you say you're going to do something, but you don't because you don't have direction and you can't get to this page of cups. My God, guys, you're knight of coins. So here we go. Another young energy. So at least something grew up a little bit, but it's in reverse. <sighs> it's like, you, it's laziness and boredom. It's like you're missing a challenge somewhere. Okay, so your Four of Swords is in the reverse. You're, you're getting sick and tired of not making any progress in this situation. Um, I actually get the feeling like, okay, so even though this is a young energy, I feel like you haven't really dedicated as much as you could to whatever the situation is. And you're actually starting to, this is actually getting a little serious, guys. You're actually starting to feel a little bit depressed by it. You're actually starting to feel um, like you might be getting anxiety. Um, you might even have nightmares about it. Yeah, I feel like you not having a solid grasp on whatever this situation is, is starting to play on you a lot. That's what all this sword's energy is. Ah, oh, the lovers, you're not making a choice. Okay, and that's exactly what, look, this is made a circle. It could be Gemini. Okay, it could mean a soulmate or somebody that you perceive as a soulmate. Yeah, and you think that something's unfair. Okay, so the justice came up in, that's Libra in the reverse. So you think that something is, um, somebody's being dishonest. Maybe that's why you're not going in. Maybe you're stalking them and you're just seeing what they put up on social media and you're not maybe approaching them for who they are. Um, but you're not, you're not seeing the results that you wish. Okay, remember these energies can be switched. Yeah, your palace of coins is in the reverse. So it's, it, you're not stable, okay? Your, your very base just isn't feeling grounded. Um, and then you have faith, the hierophant. It could be Taurus. But it's almost like you're, you need to, I feel like this is advice. You need to seek advice, but proper advice. Okay, you need to maybe get some education or learning. I am feeling that this is more counseling, Leo. I feel like there's something that you need to deal with over here. Um, that's because this is just being held out to you. Okay, so can we clarify the, oh, ah. For some reason, something d isn't going the way that you thought it was going to be. Um, now, remember, this could be somebody that you're dealing with, but this is bad luck, okay? This is uh, the wheels going backwards. You might be going back to something. Um, it's not moving ahead. But it's like the situation has so you sort of um, turned upside down, really. Can we clarify? Uh, Hierophant, please. Yeah, so the seven, seven, the seven of Pentacles came out. You need to persevere with something. You need to go inside. You need, you need to get something. This nightmare card really worries me. Okay, and then the Justice in Reverse. So something isn't going the way that you wanted it to. You need to go and you need to um, sort of go back and persevere, okay? Um, let's clarify this Wheel of Fortune. Ah, uh, yeah. So you had some sort of heartbreak, okay? Um, the Three of Swords in reverse. So you're... Um, I feel like you... This is something to do with um, a heartbreak. Okay, but this is a, you have to release the pain. See how this is coming out? Yeah, it's, and it's, it's going to, mm. you released this heart.
heartbreak too fast. It's almost in a way that you released it, but you didn't deal with it. You didn't actually deal with it. Um, and this is why the wheel has gone backwards because, and that's why all this is happening because you can't get to your page of cups because of that. Um, let's clarify the page of cups. Whoa. Yeah, you need to move on. Yeah, you need it. Your um, you, you've been. You feel like you've been through a battle. I'm not too sure how much of this is self-imposed because I have a lot of emptiness. I'm really not. Leo, what's going on with you guys? There's no page of cups. Yeah, look. You need to move on. And you need to start at the ace again. You need to go, mm, I just got it, guys. You need to go and you need to heal this aspect of you. You have the page of cups twice. The universe is trying to hand you a new beginning. And you need to go back and you need to heal that first before you can do that. And that's, you need to walk away from whatever this is. Um, you know, it's, you're going to be, you're going to have to put up with some sort of loss in order to do it, but it's almost like you, um, not that you deserve it. It's just that it was, it's something that you've stopped from happening and, but it was bound to happen and it just needs to go so that you can move on. And I think that you need help to move on from this because this is all, it's just not good guys. You gotta get out of the cycle. You need to make the wheel turn the other way, okay? You need to have faith, okay? You just need to, you just need to move ahead. Two aces of cups, sorry, it's not, no, two pages of cups. So this is a new emotional start for you and universe is asking you to do that, okay? Let me get uh, some cards for you. Lots of, lots of healing for July, okay? Do it sooner than later so that you can have a good birthday, okay? Seriously, your birthday's coming up soon, guys. Hmm? Do it soon so you can actually enjoy your birthday. Who knows, maybe you'll run into a page of cups on your birthday, right? Growth. Yeah, see, this is exactly what I've been talking about, okay? Seek out a mentor or guide. Take baby steps as you grow. Be willing to learn from others, okay? And I would advise you to really make sure that you actually seek out proper, okay? Not somebody who you want, but somebody who's going to tell you what you don't want to hear because those are the people you learn from, okay, Leo? I love you guys. Okay, let's uh, let's hope mid-July we get some progress readings. Okay, guys, please do like, and I will see you next time. Love you. Bye.